Jarris McPhail fumble, and the Illini go to town on that. Minutes later, the Illini quarterback, Johnny Johnson, who was 18 of 30 this afternoon, looks for his tight end, Kent Dilger. You are a very tall free safety right now, watching this play from 17 yards out. Why didn't you break it up at home? Illinois leads at 7 to nothing. Down by 14, the Pirates try and throw Marcus Crandall. Robert Crumpton steals it away. 23 of the Illini points today came off of five Pirate turnovers. The final score, 30 to nil. Johnny Johnson, 250 yards in the air, four touchdowns, a career high, four picks by the Illini defense. The Illini had lost seven of uh, eight prior bowl. Alamo Bowl. Opening drive, Washington State forced to punt. Baylor, though, called for roughing the kicker. So the Cougars' drive continues. Here's Chad Davis putting some air underneath it to Albert Kennedy for 33 yards. First and goal. Kevin Hicks, hey, big enough hole for you. Touchdown, Washington State. Up by a score of 7 to nothing. Second quarter, Cougars known for that passing tradition. Davis finds Bryant Thomas, 15 yards, just stays in bounds. Later that drive, Jay Dumas showing anything Thomas can do, he can do just as well. Watch him, the same ability to stay in bounds. And that would set this up. Tony Truitt from 37 yards, up and good. And the Cougars have a 10-0 lead. Coach Price feeling pretty good about himself. But at 10-3 in the fourth, Baylor gives Washington State a scare on fourth and goal. 39 seconds left. Jeff Watson picked off by Todd Jensen. Washington State wins by a score of 10-3. Watson was only 8 for 22 for 78 yards picked twice. In contrast to Davis, the Cougar quarterback, no touchdowns but no mistakes.